uh, there is a study which says that booster dose neutralizes omicron variant is it true yes because the, the data which they have received they are saying why people are more protected after the precautionary or booster dose it neutralizes the effect of the uh, omicron virus that is true there and you know the 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 role of booster doses the person who has taken that uh, two vaccines doses uh, if his vaccine was he took the second dose in the month of may after may after 9 months slowly slowly antibodies starts uh, decreasing and once the antibodies start decreasing then you become prone to the infection also so here the role of booster dose comes or precautionary dose comes or whatever you want to name it as a extra dose it will boost your immunity it will again increase the antibodies you will be in the position to fight the infection nicely and so we would like to also talk about the gap between the second dose and the booster dose fda shortens interval for booster dose of moderna to 5 months whereas the gap between second dose and booster dose for covid shield and covaxin in india is 9 to 12 months what according to you should be the ideal gap even we have discussed this thing uh, this issue in our uh, expert group also and we have asked why the america canada or europe or Amer- this england has started shorten the booster dose duration and the answer was they have seen they have, have they have got studies and the uh, vaccine two vaccines taken in india immunity is up to 9 months a good immunity is there up to 9 months so they don't want to give their aim is one more one, one 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 more thing i would like to tell you they want to give to the maximum persons and if by the way they start booster dose after 4 months the, they will have to consult it then also and they have seen the data is there so they are very particular and they are confident that nothing is going to happen so they had even we also requested that uh, we can short and on no we have got the data. second thing is particularly even we requested from indian medical association uh, platform to the ministry and to the even pradhan mantri narendra modi ji that our corona warriors our frontline warriors and comorbid patient should be given immediately the booster dose so that they will be protected in the coming time and i am highly thankful to the government they accepted this one and already that has just started and people are getting even i have taken my booster dose only 3 days back and i'm quite happy also so you just mentioned that you have taken your booster dose would you like to share your experience the kind of reactions that you faced after taking booster dose a uh, lot of uh, false informations are moving in the uh, social media uh, or in the media also my humble request is to the public is don't go on the media's news have a faith on the doctor community and as a doctor i'm telling you i have taken my booster dose only 3 days back and i'm here and hearty nothing is there and only thing which is going to help you is your vaccination and booster dose also people have started giving wrong information false information ki you may land in this one you may have this problem nothing is going to you just ask them give me one example the person has suffered from that what you are telling me then they will have no answer and so what is your uh, view point on breakthrough infection after how long should one take the booster dose if they have experienced a breakthrough infection you know already the data has been uh, circulated and the government has also decided that we have uh, 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 first dose and second dose the gap is of one month which they are giving even it was uh, increased to two months also as according to the condition prevailing and the booster dose was after nine months now breakthrough is only by the way if you suffer then at least for 6 weeks at least you should not again if you have some infection 6 weeks you should not go for the vaccination after 6 weeks or after 2 months you can go for the vaccination that will give you the immunity because infection also gives you the immunity in the beginning also we were we were talking about the herd immunity herd immunity is there if our population 80 80% population has suffered from the disease they get herd immunity then we are free but up to that level nobody can wait that's why vaccines 
आर नीडेड एंड आवर साइंटिस्ट हैव गिवन द वैक्सीन सो यू कैन से बाई गिविंग द वैक्सीन वी हैव नाउ रीच टू द हर्ड इम्यूनिटी ऑल्सो सर टॉकिंग अबाउट हर्ड इम्यूनिटी आई वुड लाइक टू हर्स देर आर लॉट ऑफ पीपल इन जनरल हु हैव मिस द सेकेंड डोज एंड राइट नाउ द टॉक्स आर गोइंग अबाउट द बूस्टर डोज एंड एनरोलमेंट ऑफ द थर्ड डोज वट एडवाइस डू यू हैव फॉर द जनरल पब्लिक हु हैव एक्सीडेड क्वाइट अ नंबर ऑफ मंथ्स I will request them only one thing: they should go to the center, and those persons who have taken the first dose and they have missed the second dose, they should go there. They will be guided properly, and those who have taken the second and they are due for the uh, third dose or for the booster dose, they should not waste the time. Already, government has announced, and lot of camps are running in the city. Go and take your booster dose, because only the thing which will save you is the uh, vaccination only. Don't believe anybody. Don't go. through the uh, social media's false information which are damaging the our uh, our fight against the covid